I, I made this video to show you how to make the puff around double crochet stitch that I use for my sage sweater. Um, I already made 10 double crochets. I'm going to start the next row chain with a chain three that counts as the first double crochet. I'm going to make another one here, the second, and here comes the stitch. The stitch says that I have to chain one. I do it. Skip next this stitch because I chain one and I do my double crochet in the next one. Now I'm going to yarn over and start the puff stitch around the double crochet. And it goes like this. Yarn over, front, back and around, and I grab some yarn and bring it to the front. And I have three loops. Again, yarn over, front, back and around, grab some yarn, and I have five loops. And the last time, yarn over, front, back and around, and bring it to the front. And I stretch a little bit, because you are gonna yarn over and pass it through all of them. Yay, it was perfect. I'm not gonna close it. If I close it, I'm gonna add one stitch. I don't want that. So I'm going to yarn over, skip this stitch to give us some room, and you'll see why, and double crochet in the next one. I wanted to show you how it looks. See why I skip it? So I give it some room for the stitch. It's a little wide because it's not a bad stitch that is in horizontal way. Yarn over, double crochet in this one, and I have two stitches, and I follow in the pattern of the sweater, so you can see it better. Chain one, and I'm going to do one double crochet in each of the last two. So I have to skip this one because I chain one. One here, and one in the last one which is the more difficult, hey, yes, got it. This is the row. Now I'm gonna show you how to put the stitches over the puff stitch. So chain, I'm gonna chain four in this time. So it's one, two, three, for the first double crochet plus a chain one. Let me fix the yarn so it doesn't bother. And I'm going to turn because I chain one, I have to skip one stitch. So next one is gonna be here in the chain one of the previous row. Sometimes the yarn split. Another chain one. And the next one is gonna be here on the top of this double crochet. You have a big hole so you can miss it. Double crochet. Yarn over, I'm gonna do a double crochet on the top of the puff stitch. Next double crochet is gonna be on the top, top of the double crochet that is inside the puff stitch. Let me find it here, there. And I'm going to continue to do double crochet for the rest of the row. So I have a chain one here in the previous row I do a double crochet here I make I'm sorry next one here and the last one is in the last stitch in the top of the three chains from last row from the previous row and there you have it here is the wrong side of the puff stitch and this is the right side. I like this side to be in the front because as you see, it pops up the stitches. So 
So this, there you have it. This is the Papa Ram double crochet stitch. Thank you.